Hey, what's up guys? It's Dan here from BedroomStyleReviews.com and in this video I'm going to be revealing the three hidden dangers of sleeping on a mattress that contains fiberglass. I'm also going to show you how to find out if your mattress currently contains fiberglass, what to do if it does, and how to avoid mattresses that contain fiberglass in the future. Now, if you are shopping for a mattress that's fiberglass free, then I've got another video which is linked at the top and in the description below that reveals my two top picks for the best mattresses that don't contain fiberglass. So first things first, what is fiberglass and why is it found in some mattresses? Well, fiberglass is a type of reinforced plastic, it's synthetic, it's man-made and in its solid state you'll find it in places like surfboards, boats and even plastic cups. Now, you'll also find it in places like insulation, so if you've ever seen it, it's like cotton candy, it's pink, uh, it's kind of fluffy, but in the case of mattresses, some companies use it as a fire barrier, so it will be layered out of sight underneath the cover or woven into the cover. So why is this bad? Why do you want to avoid fiberglass in your mattress? Well, the first hidden danger of sleeping on a mattress that contains fiberglass is a health hazard. Now, a lot of people will never realise that there's fiberglass in the mattress until either they take the cover off to wash it, um, or a little hole appears in the outer mattress cover, in which case the shards of glass may release into the atmosphere or they could poke into your skin and cause irritation. Now, the worst case scenario is that they are released into your uh, bedroom and house because there can be literally millions and millions of these particles and if they come into contact with your skin they can cause irritation but also make your eyes red, irritate your airways and increase the symptoms of things like asthma and even bronchitis. Now the second hidden danger of sleeping on a mattress that contains fiberglass is that if the shards are released into your home then the expense of removing that can cost thousands or in some people's cases over $10,000 to remove. Now, you might be thinking, why can't you just remove it yourself? Well, some people have tried, and what they've found is that the, the, there's so many shards that they get into the carpets, into the furniture, into the clothing. In some cases, they've gotten into the air vents and into the air conditioning system, which has spread it throughout the house, uh, and it just literally just becomes impossible to remove on your own. This brings me to the third hidden danger of sleeping on a mattress that contains fiberglass, and that is that in one case, somebody had to move out of the house and that was because the contamination was so bad that they literally couldn't remove it and this woman's uh, health was suffering and also the health of her kids as well. So how do you know if your current existing mattress contains fiberglass? Well, the easiest thing to do is just look at the label. Now, they might be tucked out of sight but if you look and find the label then if it says on it that it contains fiberglass or glass fibre then your mattress does contain fiberglass. If you've looked and you can't see the label or there's no mention of fiberglass then another thing that you can do is go to the website where you bought the mattress from or the manufacturer's website and look to see if it's mentioned in the specifications. Another thing that you can do is go onto um, sites like Amazon and if you can find the exact model some people may have said in the review section if this mattress contains fiberglass. Now some people say it does and it might not or vice versa but it is a generally a reasonable way of finding out if this mattress contains fiberglass or not. Now another thing that you can do is if you head over to my video where I introduce you to two mattresses that don't contain fiberglass, there's a link in the description of that video and you'll go through to my website bedroomstylereviews.com where I've included a table of many of the mattresses that do contain fiberglass. Now this is primary research, I reached out to the mattress manufacturers. I also contacted customer support and did external research to find out and validate if these mattresses do contain fiberglass or not. So if you look at that table, that's going to give you an idea of what to avoid and then you can look at the list and find out the mattresses that don't contain fiberglass that are going to be suitable for you. Now a couple of warning signs that your mattress may contain fiberglass. This isn't a definite diagnosis, but if you've bought a cheap memory foam mattress, then there's a fair chance that it contains fiberglass because the lower end models, they try to save money and one of the best ways to do this in their opinion is to make their fire barrier out of fiberglass because it's so cheap uh, rather than investing more money to maybe use something like a thistle or an organic material. And similarly, if your memory foam mattress was bought in a place like China then the chances of it containing fiberglass increase because uh, manufacturers over there are less stringent in terms of the uh, protocols that they have to follow in regards to flammability standards. So if you've got a cheap memory foam mattress uh, and you've ordered it online from a place like China, then I would definitely be doing more research to find out if it contains fiberglass or not. So if you've looked at your mattress and you have found 
that it contains fiberglass either through the label or external research uh, you might be wondering what to do next well the first thing is don't panic if the cover has not been torn and you've not taken the cover off then you should be safe for now however it is a risk you are really sleeping on a ticking time bomb so if there is a hole in the cover then what I would suggest you do is just wrap the mattress in a blanket or something and take it to a place like the garage because you don't want to risk these shards being released into your home so it might sound a bit extreme but it's something you really want to avoid now if there's no hole in the cover then definitely don't take the cover off because this is how most people inadvertently find out that there's fiberglass in the mattress so if that describes your situation then I would just be very careful and I would consider swapping that mattress for a new one that doesn't contain fiberglass. Which brings me to my final point, which is how do you actually avoid buying a mattress that contains fiberglass? Well, you can do all of the external research, like I said, looking at the labels, looking at the reviews, and you can also look for mattresses that are classified as organic. Now, these are gonna be much more expensive, but if it's organic and it's certified, then that's gonna basically mean that there's no synthetic chemicals uh, and fiberglass is not gonna be found in there either. Now. Finding an organic mattress is another mission in itself. So what I suggest you do is go and check out my video where I introduce you to my two top picks for the mattresses uh, that I recommend that don't contain fiberglass. One's organic and one of them isn't organic. However, it's very, very cheap and it's probably, in my opinion, the best mattress that you can buy on a budget that doesn't contain fiberglass. So if you're interested in that video, um, click up there or click the link in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, then make sure to hit the like button and subscribe because I'm coming out with this type of content all the time. So if you're interested in improving your bedroom decor, buying a new mattress, headboards, accessories, anything, then there's gonna be content coming out all the time that's gonna help you do that.